Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Happy Tuesday, you guys. Hope you guys are having a great day. Hope you guys had a great evening last night. So today's going to be another what I eat in a day video. You guys, I got a lot going on over here. So I'm just going to show you what I'm eating today. So right now I'm having some water and I'm having the strawberry lemonade water enhancer. And I have a little bit of lemon juice in there. So um, I'm about to make me some breakfast this morning. I've already had coffee. I had, let me show you the coffee that I had, you guys. Um, I got this out of Publix yesterday. I went to Publix for my mom. And it is the community coffee. It's the pecan praline. And this coffee is really good. I had some of this, some of it this morning. And um, I really enjoyed this coffee. So that's what it is, in case you didn't see it. And it tastes really good. So right now, like I said, I'm having my water. And I'm going to make myself... Um, something to eat this morning for breakfast and when I do that I'm going to come back and show you exactly what I'm having. All right you guys so I'm just going to show you guys a little bit of what we've got going on here. So I've got some boxes here you guys we are moving. We are packing up this apartment and we are moving. Um, I am already filming a whole like moving vlog you're probably going to see me in the same shirt as some of the in, in that other video that I'm not going to put out until um, after we're all moved out. We're still here right now, but when those videos come out, we'll be already be moved. But I just figured I would show you guys a little bit of what I got going on here. Every day I say I got I'm busy, I'm busy, I'm busy because I'm I'm moving, and in the midst of trying to pack up this apartment, I'm leaving in a few days to go see my daughter. So. With moving and shaking over here, getting things, I'm gonna go check my bacon. Give me one second. This stuff, doing all of this, and moving and leaving town, yeah, it's a lot. So, right now, I'm just gonna start packing up a couple of like little, like these little things that I have going on here. Stuff that I'm not gonna be using, you know. I bought this and haven't even used it yet, so. I'm just gonna go ahead and start, um, yeah, packing this stuff up. This is glass, but like it's all like contained. So I'm just gonna sit it in here. It's fine to just sit in there. And this goes with that set. I'm just gonna sit that in there as well. These little things here, I'm gonna wrap in some paper and put in this box. You guys, moving is a chore. But you know what? I'm thankful that I can do it. I'm very thankful and very blessed that I am able to move because it has been a long time coming. You know, we've been in this apartment for, we've been in this complex for like nine years. We've been in this apartment for five, four years and we lived in a different apartment in the same complex for five years. Our first five years, we were on the other side, and then I needed a bigger place that was only a two-bedroom. I needed a three-bedroom, and then we transferred over to this apartment for the last four years. So it's been about almost 10 years we've been living in this complex. And while I loved it when we first moved in, I don't love it anymore. <laughs> You know, um, it has just become, it has become not a good place to live anymore, I want to say. You know, my children are, um, my children are adults now, and um, when I first moved in here, and like I said, it was great. The kids loved it. And now there's just a lot of um, stuff that's not so great about it anymore. So, you know, while so moving is not easy, it is definitely necessary. It is definitely necessary to do so. So, I think so. I love these little things. I got them out of, uh, during the holidays, out of Walmart. So cute. 
like a quarter of a cup. This is a third of a cup, half a cup and one cup. Got the little gingerbread man on there. He's adorable. So it has become necessary um, for us to pack up and move out of here. So basically we are moving um, 30 minutes away from where we are now. Let me check my bacon one more time. I'm moving 30 minutes from where we are now, and it's a better area, a better neighborhood, a better everything. And of course, you know, with the better everything comes, you know, the higher rent. Um, which in actuality, I'm okay with, because again, like I said, it's a better area. Um, I'm not gonna pack this up yet, I might need my measuring cup. But yeah, so, that's um, where we are with this whole like moving thing. Like I said, I have a whole vlog coming out about it. I just wanted to share a little bit with you guys. Um, going through all this stuff is a lot. So I just wanted to clean up my microwave really quickly and just pack up some stuff that I know that I'm not gonna need in the near future. And yeah, so this is what I got going on in my kitchen. Uh, getting some boxes packed up and right now I'm going to show you how to have my first meal. All right, you guys, so this is my first meal. I'm just having some bacon and eggs for my first meal today. Keeping it nice and simple, all protein, and I am drinking on my water. All right, you guys, I'm going to enjoy my bacon and eggs. And when I come back, I'll be back in a little bit. Alrighty y'all, so it is 5.30, it is dinner time, and I am having some nachos. I guess you call these walking nachos. I don't know, but they're just nachos with ground beef, cheese, sour cream, and some lettuce on top and some salsa. And to drink, I am having the Dr. Pepper Zero Sugar, the Creamy Coconut. If you guys have not tried this, it's so good. I tried it for the first time today. I got it out of Publix. It's so good, Dr. Pepper Creamy Coconut. And they also have the full sugar version too, if you prefer that one. So this is what I'm having to drink. And the chips that I have on here is not Quest chips. It is these um, Siete grain-free tortilla chips. Someone left a comment on one of my videos telling me to try these. So I decided to go ahead and try them and they are good. And they, are, they have a squeeze of lime. So I did get these. And the carb count on these is higher than what I would normally like, but it's okay because everything else in here is pretty low carb. So the chips, these are the chips I'm using, like I said. And so this is what I'm doing for dinner, you guys. Just some nachos and my drink here. And that is it, you guys. That's all I have for you today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Give it a like for me, you guys. Also, you can leave a question or a comment down below. And yeah, so as always, you guys, I will see you on the next one. Take care and have a great night.